Hey guys, thanks for joining us today. Putting a quick video together to ensure that everybody out there knows how to inspect your AED and make sure that your business, your place of employment is rescue ready. So when we do this, there's a couple things that you wanna look for. Number one, you wanna make sure you're looking for the ready indicator light. So what this will look like on most AED machines is you'll see a green kind of flashing light that'll be beeping. That will indicate that your machine is rescue ready. And on top of that, the second thing you're gonna look for is individually inspecting either your pad pack or your batteries and pads uh, if they're sold separate, depending on the kind of device you have. So an example of what that looks like is when you're taking a look at your device, you're gonna see that light flashing, that green indicator light you see there. That means your AED machine is rescue ready. Once you take a look at that, you also wanna look at the back and all of these manufacturers have different types of stickers that will have expiration dates for you. And again, we have a pad pack here with the heart sign model. So when you remove that pad pack, keep in mind, these are batteries and pads all in one. So your pads come in the back as well. And again, this is just kind of one example of what an AED could look like. So you wanna make sure you check all of those things. When you're taking a look at a device that is no longer registered, compliant, good to go, for example here, the LifePak Express, you're gonna see red. It's kind of difficult to see here, but when you take a look here, you can see the red battery light. That's indicating that there is an issue with uh, the battery. Pads are likely expired as well. So again, this type of device is different from the one I just showed you in the sense that batteries and pads are both sold separately. So what that means for you is if you have a device like that, you wanna make sure you're checking not just the battery for expiration date, but you're also checking the pads as well because you might have to replace maybe just the pads, but your battery's good for another year or two. So again, just making sure you're tracking those things. We should be uh, inspecting AED machines in the workplace every month. Typically what you'll see with these devices, it will have a little inspection tag, whether it be a sticker or kind of just hanging off the side of the device, something kind of like this you see here. Um, and that will have you take a note of, you know, the day of the inspection and just ensuring that you're rescue ready. So again, with that said, the green indicator light should be flashing. You also want to check those batteries and pads, or if you have a pad pack, which again includes batteries and pads together, make sure that you are good to go with your expiration dates. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. I encourage everyone to get out there. Those of you that have an AED machine on site, just take a quick run through. It's amazing to see how many businesses we go in and we check the AED machines just as a complimentary service and they are expired. So you wanna make sure you're rescue ready, have those things in place and also order those ahead of time. Don't wait till the very last minute to put an order in. Sometimes you're gonna experience a back order on these accessories. With that said, if there's anything we can do to help you out, feel free to uh, subscribe. There's some links below you can click on. And again, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Thanks.